Well, I guess I've got to make some more food for the bees. But Indian picture really like that. Anyway, I've got the the sugar stored in the spare room. It stays nice and dry in here. I keep the doors closed most of the time. And so I take 10 of those, actually 11. I mix it. And this is my mixer. So I use hot, hot water. And then I put the mount the drill in here. And it's got a paddle. And then over here I've got my hopper. just pour the sugar and mix it at the same time and it gives me about a hundred gallons of sugar water feed it's usually one to one then I add some nutrients some vitamins for the bees and then to sterilize it so that it doesn't go moldy and this is new for everybody I add 200 milliliters of uh, hydrogen peroxide probably a little bit more this time it's going to be warmer so uh, the demand on the hydrogen peroxide just like chlorine for water treatment uh will be higher because of warmer weather finally but yeah the dandelions are gone now so before now and when the main flowering happens which is latter part or of june to the middle of july everything's behind this year so we'll see but anyhow we'll give them a good feed and keep them healthy and we're gonna have some honey this year <laughs>